hi guys it's promise sebastian here again okay today we'll be sharing you guys my 10 best phones before we proceed if you know you've not subscribed to my channel just do me a favor of subscribing then on the bell and notification so when i drop an awesome video you get notified okay so i will start with the cosy phones not the sans ones so i'll start with the cosy phones i mean the sherry phones okay the first of it is amsterdam the day i got that phone i never stopped using it i so much love the phone okay i had to design this thing to use it to explain the phone so that you guys will see how it looks okay let's start from the thank you the amsterdam is a sherry font that is a cursive font so you can use it for paragraphs so it's only like this thank you now we can use it on so let's try it on our thank you here so this is my amsterdam this is my amsterdam you see it is a very very awesome font very awesome cosy phone perfect and okay i even use it on business flyers and it will still look okay okay so it's a nice font and i'm gonna drop them for you guys on the drive don't worry so the next is um sacramento next is sacramento okay let's try that one out okay so that is it here is an awesome nice font you can use on your design is an awesome cosy font okay so i use this one also but i don't use it on business flyers because it has coins that that more than the amsterdam phone okay so this is a nice phone the name is sacramento okay i'm gonna drop this font on my drive so you go get it and use on your design okay let's try the third one is amela amela i use this font very well before i got amsterdam and i started using that flex okay so let's see what it looks like it's a big cursive phone so if your typing was small it's gonna make it large i'll still have to reduce the size here okay so this is my amela amela so it's a nice cursive phone to use for whatever cursive typing you want to do okay so the name is amela and i use i use this font often before i got amsterdam okay the fourth one is uh aldania 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 let's see what it looks like so this is it is aldania you can use it on wedding uh, designs because it has a lot of nice quality phones so this is it is aldania that's my fourth i'm starting with the cursive uh, the cursive ones so at the ending i will list out the uh, sans ones which are the ones you can use for paragraph and headings and the rest so this is aldania aldania i will drop them on my drive in the description so you go get them the fifth one is rambler rambler let's see what it looks like Rambler has two pattern he has the italic one and he has the main rambler so i use the main one instead of the italic one so this is our rambler here you see it's a nice font to use on your design all these fonts are awesome are awesome best selected for you know i'm not i don't design rubbish so whatever i select is always awesome so this is the rambler font it's nice and awesome okay the next is blackjack blackjack i use this phone whenever i don't actually need much cost but it's still a sherry phone let's see what a blackjack looks like so this is my blackjack here it doesn't have that much coil it doesn't have that it's not that much cursive okay but it's also okay and awesome to use then the last is uh autumn that's the name of the last one for the cursive i'm going to take you guys i'm going to take you guys on the on the sans ones this this uh, is autumn or uh, autumn for the cursive autumn in november autumn in november when i need a bold cursive phone that's why i go for this a bold cursive phone but i, I still the, my best and will still be my best is amsterdam what a wonderful phone okay so let's get over to the sans font my current best sans font is josephine josephine sans it has 
it has it really has a lot of um, styles. It has up to eight or nine styles. Just thin is a sans foot, but it's really nice. Is it on my design also? Is it often? So this is the Josephine Italic Josephine regular, but I need the bold one. So I will send you guys this phone. I'll drop the link to my drive. This is the Josephine Light, Josephine Light Italic, and Josephine Semi Bold and Josephine Bold. So this is it. It's a sans font. You can use it for paragraphs. You can let me use it on this paragraph. Let me use the regular on this my type in here. I didn't use the sheriff, the cursive fonts on my paragraph because you don't use sheriff fonts on paragraph. It's only sans fonts you use or sans sheriff fonts, but suitable paragraph fonts is just sans. Okay, so let me use the uh, just fin font on my paragraph here so you guys see what it looks like. I can't encounter it. I reduced the rate at which I use Monserrat. So this is it here. Okay, so it's an auction for it. it has like up to eight, nine styles. Then my second one is Monserrat. Everybody has the phone, so I don't think I really need to show you guys, but I'll still show you guys. Everybody has Monserrat. If you don't have Monserrat, that means you're still new to graphic design. If you're if you're an old man in graphic design, you should have Monserrat font because it's very very it's the most popular font. I don't know whether there is another font beating it now. Okay, so this is Monserrat font here. This is Monserrat, and let's change our typing back to Monserrat because it's a sans font that we can use it on paragraphs. So mind me, I said my 10th best font. So we are actually at the ninth one. So the last one is what I'm coming to show you guys. It's a wonderful font. So back to our Monserrat. Okay, so this is Monserrat. Everyone knows it's an awesome font. It has all the whole styles you need. It has up to more than you even have different Monserrat alternative. What a wonderful font. Okay, so if you don't know about Monserrat, just go and get it now. It's the most popular font last I checked, and it's really, really awesome. It has all the whole styles you need in a font. Okay, so the last, the last font is Lato. You know, I use Lato, it's a sans font, but you know, it's not that uh, good like Monserrat and this is my Josephine. I just showed you guys, but why I like it is it reduces space. Let's say it reduces space for me. Let's say this paragraph, let me unlock my paragraph here. Let's say my paragraph is getting close to the uh, width of my flyer design, and I need a font to bring it to make it not to get close, like to make it not to get close without reducing the size or making it less visible so if i want to make this guy come uh, shift from the edge now i have to reduce the size of this phone but there are fonts that are not wide that you can use them and reduce the size of your of your typing i think this josephine also does it but monster uh, lato is the best that is why i want to introduce you guys to the phone it's awesome so once you have writings like this you can just simply change fonts to give enough space so if, if your design is close to the edge it looks clustered and it doesn't make sense so you look for a font preferably instead of reducing the size because if you reduce the size if it was 14 then you reduce it it's not 13 and not up to standard for paragraph so it's going to be hard for the reader to scale through see i changed to lato what do you see? This belief in is even in this line. You see how the, the font can reduce the size or the width. You see, belief in is now in this second, in this first line. And still, the, the, the writing is still not in the age. Look at if it was Monserrat. Look at how it was in Monserrat now. This is how the text was. You can, you can always do more than you think. Never be discouraged. That is where the first line stopped in Monserrat. But you see where this one now, you see where the age is. That means it's even it's even allowing believing to still come in the same line and we still have enough space. If you are still confused, let me show you guys. This is Monserrat regular. What do you see? You see, it's this is the discouraged here. You see where discouraged stop. This if you read this first line well. You see, never be discouraged. It's in the first line. Believing is in the second line. While we use Lato now, when we switch to Lato. Lato regular, let's use Lato right because it's still visible. See, 
Lato light we, we can believe in is now in this, this first line and the space itself it's still even shorter so look at how it's is in in Montserrat so this is the line the first line is stopped at this coin in Montserrat this second line you see the enough space we got with this font now so that's why I use Lato whenever I have issues like this I change font and get something okay so thanks for watching and uh have a great day if you've not subscribed to my channel you're missing a lot just subscribe so that when i drop an awesome video like this you get notified and come grab the awesome content okay so have a great day and thanks once again